Okay, so we got the check engine light on. Let's see what we got the code. MCM. One one seven two. It's not really telling you anything, but I did my research, and this is it. Turbo speed sensor goes right by the turbo in the intake manifold or something like that. It's right before the turbo. Between the filter and turbo, there is a. It's like right there. So my check engine is on and off, like like trying to drive or something. Comes on, comes off. going on and off and this is my my different code it's not showing anything but I know what is it but yeah let's go ahead and change this thing it's gonna be pretty quick install hello guys so today I'm installing the intake turbo speed sensor on a Cascadia 2019, 2020 year, 21, so it's a newer body. So to change it, it's pretty easy. I didn't get my tripod this this time, so let's work with the head. So basically, the sensor locates right here in that tube right there. This is it, it's right here. Let's see the other angle. Right there. So, let's go ahead and change it. So there is just a one, uh, one bolt here. One bolt on top, oh, light is killing me. And there is a plug of wire. So this is the sensor. So we use our drill. Bottom out. Let's get the top. Oops. And we can take take it out. But we need to unplug the sensor first. Um, you can't really show it, so you have to just kind of feel it. It's pushed and pull it right here so you go ahead and kind of wiggle it to wiggle around let's do the Sensor. Give you the sensor right here. Okay, so how easy to change this sensor? Basically, you have to take it. Uh, it's a T30. This is the old one.
and the new one and we have a problem we have a problem that the old one is different will not fit so I was buying it by VIN number but no luck I guess let's just clean it for now and yeah so make sure you will get the right one so guys if you remember I was saying about fail about the um, about those two sensors actually it was just a just a cup or the cover so let's go ahead and get that old sensor and install a new one Okay, so it's installed, let's put the, everything back. And don't forget your plug. Okay, so we're done with the sensor, so it's gonna be, uh, if you still have a check engine on, it will go away pretty, pretty quick, so let's roll it.